Hey guys, Icebreaker back again. Uh, in this video I'm going to show you how you can clear all the shield gems from Centaur. Which is this map here. You can see it's got, the two, it's got uh, two sets over this side and this side. Um, this one also has a hot beach as well. So what we're going to do is uh, take out the rocket launcher and one of the mortars as well this is so obviously our attack is a bit easier and also takes the mortar out of the equation for the landing for the person who goes next and rushes the core so first thing we're going to do is is we're going to mark the mortar with an artillery and then we're going to land with a smoke We've got two boat suzukas and sparky and we've got the universal remote and what the idea here is to I'm gonna hack the mortar as you see there she's targeted the mortar she's selected the mortar straight away because because we marked it with the uh, artillery Zuka is going to take out the rocket launcher and the boom cannons are taking care of the mortar so that means we can go on now without needing extra GBE for smokes and the next attacker can uh, just do a normal flare landing okay so for the right side what we've got is one boat of riflemen <coughs> and two boat suzukas plus plus the few girls we've got left over from the rocket launcher the idea is that the boat of rifles will be sort of cannon fodder if you like for the boom cannons they'll be taken out one at a time from the boom cannon as well the zookas get to do the damage and clear the actual defenses put some critters down as well just to um just so that not so many rifles die too quickly you can obviously sparky's critters as well so i'm gonna let them clear a little bit and what we're going to do is we're going to flare over to the right another box of critters it's just a case now of letting them clear, <clears throat> let them do their own thing and find their own path and they'll clear the clear the shield gems. This is actually a good moment to be stacking GBE as well. Whilst you haven't got a you haven't got to protect these troops, you can let them die as long as the shield gems go down. We don't need the hero. So once the SGs are gone down this side, what we're gonna do is leave those troops there and we're going to come over to this far corner on the left side you can see the mortar there doesn't range top left corner of the beach so what we do is is drop the flags for three boats azukas right up in that top corner of the beach there and then you flare over to the little gap here behind what is the nine o'clock shield gen into the little gap there by the wall. Smoky troops over. Now, there's two ways of doing this bit. <clears throat> I like to use two smokes, it takes the pressure off, especially when you've got the GBE spare. I'm gonna um gonna drop one smoke on the three o'clock shield gem. Then I'm going to wait a second or two and then throw the second one like that for the Zookas. This is because if you take a look at the at this two smoke timers for the last two smokes there, you can see how the one on the right is going to expire a lot sooner than the one on the left. And that's because we're going to put a box of critters in that smoke like that, which means now that the critters will come out of the smoke first and these mortars and snipers and that will lock on to uh, the, the critters before the girls which give you loads of time then just to let the girls do their thing they'll take them out I do put a shock on these ones on the bottom side because this one here tends to shoot straight for the girls because obviously the girls are closer to that than what they are at the critters on the three o'clock shield gen so once that set of shields go down you can uh, clear the mines 
what I normally hear in front of core. And then dump any spare GBE on on the core or try and bar out the other the other mortar, which you don't really need to do. So yeah, that's that's how you get both sets of shields on Centaur. Hope that helps explain how it's done and gives you guys a bit of confidence to go on and do it yourselves. Make sure you post those videos, guys. Good luck.